giant Godo moment. Uh, the Legends of the Wings Awakening for the Nintendo for the Nintendo Switch. If I were to guess, this is probably my seventh Let's Play. I'll put it on screen right now because I actually don't know what number Let's Play this is. Actually, you know, I should know, but I don't. So let's just start up with um, just go into my file. Yes, yeah, Steven, of course, I have King Diddy there as your cell. I may have seen if I clicked. I clicked on it quite fast. My microphone is not cooperating with me. It's not staying still. Aye, And with that, Link has uh, crashed onto shore, and he's now on his island. Interesting. Okay, we can continue on. Press Z and R, okay. Fail. Press L and R. There we go. Tell him, push them together. Press them together. Now, as you can see, I beat the game. This is my uh, my furthest saved point file. If I even said that right. I don't think I said that right. I didn't go after all the hard containers. And so I didn't go after all the pieces of heart, I should say. I did not go after all the secret she shells either. So this is not going to be hundred percent let's play. I'll be, I won't be collecting all the secret she shells, and I won't be collecting all the pieces of heart. There's thirty-two pieces of heart and fifty secret she shells, but I will collect as many as I can. Uh, but if it's like a really difficult one, because some of hard piece, some pieces are hard and, and secret she shells are hard to get because you have to do crazy things and. It's not my cup of tea, really, but um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be skipping on those, so just fair warning. So let's actually go to uh, well, I guess I can delete both these files here. Let me see, let's go down to delete. What the heck is supposed to be going on? For three seconds, okay. There we go, okay. And let's delete this file too. That's all we want. Okay, let's go to file one. I'm gonna play normal difficulty. I'm not really good at this game, so human mode's not gonna be a thing for me. Take uh, take twice as much damage and have no hard drops for advanced players. I'm just gonna go with normal then. The classic difficulty level. That's what I want. And enter your name. Let's yeah. Let's just do wink. Wink's fine. I want to name my file wink. Okie dokie. Oh, wink's having like a nightmare or something. Jeez, poor guy. Marion says, "What a relief." I thought you'd never wake up and you were tossing, turning. What, Zelda? No, my name's Marion. You just must still be feeling a little bit woozy. Uh, this, you are on Cold Island. Okay. So, I have this list of objectives I wrote down in my notes. Yeah. Let's see. Talk to people. Including... 
Couldn't you die on the phone? Okay, of course. Let's talk to Taryn here. Yeah, this guy's ter named Taryn. Well, Wink, you finally snapped out of it. My na name's Taryn. Hope you're feeling better. Stuff like that. I cook too fast. Darn it. Well, okay, what? Uh, what? How, how did I know your name? Well, it's we you think it's weird, eh? Well, I saw it in the back of this shield. Yeah. You got the shield back called R to repel enemies with it. Cool. I'll keep that in mind. So press R like I'm doing. I'm using the switch broker drawer, by the way, as my controller. You can, uh, no, you can, uh, you pull out your shield and, uh, defend, defend yourself, basically. This is what the shield does, it's, you know, shield defends yourself, of course, you, you know that. If you have a, a good sense of adventure games and whatnot. Plus, it's kind of common sense, but in case you don't know, there you go. The shields can protect you, and it's very handy sometimes, too. Oof, this looks heavy, heavier than heavy. Okay, your current strength won't cut it. Okay, we can't get those yet, but eventually we might. So if we exit the house and talk to people, let's talk to some people. That sounds like a good plan. We're in Mabe Village now. Awesome. Let's start by talking to this elder. Yahoo! I'm fine, and you? She's sweeping up. She was sweeping in the grass. Interesting. Here's a chain chomp, by the way. We'll get to that in a second, actually. Maybe in the next part or so, I don't know. I kind of just wanted to lay back and relax this first part. Not do, not do anything too serious. Here's a fox, by the way. Right here's a shop, which we'll get to later again. I don't have a sword, so I can't cut this grass yet, so that stinks. Let's just talk to our dad. We talked to our dad on the phone, just like we do in Earthbound. Isn't that just great? Let's talk to our dad. Bring, bring, hell, it's you. It's you. Mean, okay, yeah. He asked me anything about that, and you can ask me a call. It's a, you know, there's a library in the village that might have good information for you. Talk to your waiter quick. So I don't think that was your dad exactly, but it was someone else. Eventually, I'll just talk to your dad on that some kind of phone and whatnot. So, wait, I want to talk to the Santa looking person in this house real quick. Because that would be great. Here he is. Uh, hmm, how to say, please call outside. Okay, um, please call outside. It seems like the old man, you really is a shy guy in person. I can't pronounce his name, jeez. Here's the pause menu, by the way. We're gonna get a fair amount of items for our adventure. And right here we have a shield and a green tunic. Yeah, a green tunic, yeah. Shield. The little heart that you see right there is for heart pieces, or, or pieces of heart, I should say. I always try to call it pieces of hearts. And then uh, this is your save and load a screen. Very helpful when you want to save and whatnot. Then you get the map. Which we only have this much covered so far, but this is gonna be a big map we're gonna explore. This whole island's just so big. And this is the map for it right here that we're viewing. And that's really it for now, okay. Oh yeah, it also has your also has your rupee count and your X and Y buttons for your X and Y items. We'll get to that later. So yeah, we have no rupees right now, which kinda stinks, but we'll get them eventually. I promise. So let's go visit the library. Let's talk to these guys first. See, I heard that you can press minus to look at the on the map. Not only that, can you stick pins on with A and remember with stuff with X. I think that's what it said, but I don't under understand what they mean by that. Yeah. <laughs> I hear that you're running out of. If you when you're running out of hearts, you better go find a big fairy. Why? I have no idea. I'm just a kid. Okay, whatever. Here's the library. I'm gonna show off all these books real quick, hopefully. Alice to Kohan Line, you can look at the map, the name of the place. Do you wanna look up at the map? Look, let's just take a look see. All those places on the map, awesome. Pause now if you wanna see all of it. All these places we're gonna explore, that's interesting. Let's see, uh, Dark Secrets of the Mysterious Kohan, do you wanna read it? Yeah, sure. 
guess what was what was this? You can't you can't read the tiny print without the aid of magnifying lens. But where would you get one of those? Maybe if you tend when people's a hand, they'll lend you a lens. Yeah, we'll get to that later. How to handle your shield like a pro? How to read this book? Sure. If you hold R and you invent yourself for enemy attacks, you push enemies too. Besides the standard shield, there is also a mirrored variety that can reflect beams. We'll get to that later. Seek of the, seek of the willing blade. Read the book? Okay, yeah. The one point is that it has handed down from generation to generation about the family of the seer of the hero. To use it, you hold down the button and build up your power. You can have enough. When you have enough, you can release it. Can you miss, master this? Hopefully, I can. There's a book on the top shelf that which you can't get yet. That kind of stinks. Uh, maps and memories guidebook. Read this book. Yes, okay, let's read it. Uh, you can see that on by pressing the minus button. Zoom in. And out with, we're out with, um, the R. Okay, the, f the rough parts of the map are a place you haven't visited yet. If there's a place you want to visit to remember for later, you can press A to mark with the pin. Press X to look back at your adventure for visiting memories of things you learned, of conversations you had. Ah, uh, how convenient. Okay. Selecting the item that was right for you. Yes, just read this book. The sub screen you can get to with with a uh, plus is very useful. You can select your favorite items for the X and Y buttons there. Cool. Try to many, try many different things. You find what's right for you. And here we go. Let's get the last book real quick. Fun with bombs. Read the book. Okay, yeah. After you put a bomb down, you can pick it up and press pressing A again. You can then throw the pushing, uh, throw it by pushing A one more time. Did you know that? Yeah, I did actually. And we can't quite get this book on the top of the shelf right here. It she thinks this is a bookshelf. What you can see that? Okay. Wait, what'd you say? It's a bookshelf. What you could see that? Okay. 